Hello, today I'm going to talk to you about the three keys Shift, Control and Alt. Those keys in themselves, I'm pointing to them in the left hand corner, they do nothing except make a diff all the other keys do something differently. So for example, if you're working in Microsoft Word and you tap the letter N, then you get a lowercase n. If you hold down the Shift and press N, you will then get a capital N. If you hold down Control and then tap the letter N, then you will get a new document. There is a code for um, the various shortcuts like that, um, but you don't need to know them just yet. What, it is, what is important is that you remember that the Shift, the Control and the Alt, when they're being used, they are held down and the other key which is um, requested is tapped. Don't hold it down, so because if you hold down the shift and the N, you'll get dirty great long line of capital N's. So just tap the other key, and when you've tapped the other key, you can then lift your finger off the shift, the control, or the alt. I would suggest that you only use the three on the left hand side because. Um, they're the most convenient. There is another key, Alt G R, which does nothing like the Alt key, which is usually placed around the right hand side. At that stage, that's really all that you need to know. So when the computer is switching on and it says hold down Control Alt Delete, you put one finger on the Control key, one finger on the Alt key, and then tap the Del or Delete key and then you lift your finger off the control and the alt. Okay, that's that. Thank you.